This video will demonstrate the famous Diels-Alder reaction and the hydrolysis of the anhydride to form the corresponding dye acid. Prepare a hot water bath between 60 and 70 degrees centigrade by setting your hot plate to about 3. While your water bath is warming, clean a Buchner funnel and a 10 milliliter round bottom flask. Rinse them with acetone and allow them to dry. Weigh out 180 to 200 milligrams of maleic anhydride into the 10 milliliter round bottom flask. Once you have your exact weight, calculate the volume in milliliters for one equivalent of 2,3-dimethyl-1,3-butadiene. Record your masses in the data table in your lab manual. Next, add a stir bar and one milliliter of PEG 200. Then, using a needle and syringe, add your calculated equivalent of 2,3-dimethyl-1,3-butadiene to the round bottom flask. Be sure to follow all the established safety protocols for obtaining and disposing of your syringe and needle. Carefully connect your round bottom to the condenser. Lower it into the water bath and heat for about 20 minutes. While the reaction is heating, prepare the Buchner funnel suction apparatus. Also, Place 50 milliliters of water into a 100 milliliter beaker and pre-weigh a watch glass and piece of filter paper. After 20 minutes, pour your reaction into the 50 milliliters of water. Note that the round bottom flask will only be warm to the touch due to the low temperature of the water bath. As you pour your reaction mixture into the water, a precipitate will form. This is your anhydride product. Filter your product, keeping the vacuum going for about two minutes until it is dry. Weigh the product and record the weight. Further analyze the product as directed by your instructor. Transfer your crystals into a clean 50 milliliter beaker containing a stir bar. Add 10 milliliters of 25% acetone in water and stir. Then add two to three drops of concentrated hydrochloric acid. Heat the mixture in your water bath while stirring at 60 to 80 degrees centigrade for 10 minutes. Do not allow the mixture to boil. While it is heating, prepare an ice bath. After 10 minutes, place the beaker in the ice bath and allow the crystals to form. While the solution is cooling, set up the filtration apparatus and pre-weigh a watch glass and filter paper. Filter the crystals until dry, about two minutes. Weigh your crystals of the corresponding dye acid and record the weight. Further analyze your dye acid product as directed by your instructor. Good luck and thanks for watching.